Thanks, Justin. It's Tuesday, and that means Pet Pals. Deputy Stephen Watson with New Hanover County Animal Services is here to introduce us to this little guy. He's quite, he got quite a bit of energy. Energy and personality plus. Beautiful. We, we, I called him Bubba, and you thought maybe his name was Bubba, yeah. but I think it should be Skippy. Skippy? <laughs> Skippy boy. So now he's fully grown, right? He is fully grown. He's a pug mix uh that's five years old we believe i found him uh we got a call at the Hugh McRae dog park he and his uh little running mate were in the dog park left alone nobody ever came to claim him he was already neutered mm. um and so we held him for the five working days uh hoping that the owner would come forward but they never did so we never know anybody's situation sadly and they probably thought that was the best option which it turns out for he and his partner, sure enough, they are. Well, the good thing is that he looks healthy and happy, and he, he just needs a home now, and right? Happy. So he did meet criteria for our adoption program. He was vaccinated against the common dog diseases, given a one-year rabies shot, and he is microchipped. So that's a super value for anybody that is coming to get this wonderful little pug mix. I just love him. Uh, just loves the ball and very energetic and loving. Okay, we got a little less than two minutes. Real quickly, um, the big topic, Florence, uh, how's that <laughs> impacting your world? Okay, so hopefully everybody's f uh, finalizing their uh, preparations for the coming storm. Uh, we are activating our co-location shelter at Trask. That is for citizens of New Hanover County that have an animal, pet, cat, or dog. That's uh, the only things that we take. Uh, 34 cats and 80 dogs no dogs over 60 pounds they will be managed by uh, the animal services professionally trained staff the uh, owners will stay on the other end we can schedule walks and things of that nature um, also the main shelter at 180 division drive is opening its doors for New Hanover County citizens only, they're gonna require ID to house their dogs there and if they're, if they're leaving town um, and uh, they have to pick the dogs up once the state of emergency is lifted within 24 hours. Just real quickly, bring your own food if the dog is on a special diet, otherwise we provide a dry kibble and all of that sort of thing and any medications. All right, good information. And where do you go if you want to find this little friend? 180 Division Drive. Call for uh, call for uh, our hours of operation because I really don't know what's going to be going on okay. right now. All right. Thank you, Jeff. Thanks a lot. And don't go away. We'll be right back with a recap of today's headlines and another look at Hurricane Florence. Mm -hmm.